was it like uh, shooting and casting an ensemble piece like this when you have a lot of different characters balance each other out? I think even in the writing, you know, I, I, I don't think you should have any, ca any screenplay where there are, you know, non-characters. Let, let me put it this way. When I've written small roles that are underwritten, they usually stand out as badly, ca badly cast and badly performed. Whereas the big, major, complicated roles just happen because the actor is stronger. So, you know, you just don't want to shortchange anyone. And here, of course, you know, the ensemble is key, particularly the ensemble of, of the servants, because that was, you know, that group around the table, you wanted it to be, you know, interesting and varied the way it was written. And you're always fighting with period, you know, is it genuine? Well, nothing is genuine. You know, nothing in, no movie's genuine. It, every movie's a confection, but you want to find a tone for it in the faces. You know, there is really some elementary questions that you think are funny, but that I always ask myself. Like, you know, what are the age groups of these characters? If this actress looks a little bit like this other actress, I'm not casting her, especially in an ensemble. I don't want people to say, is this made, the, you know, just that balance of, of looks and tones and styles and if two characters have the same kind of humor. I mean, this isn't, these aren't the most important things, but, you know, it all counts.